Hi, my name is Robert. Thanks for joining me for today's lesson. Today, we're going to look at 63 words and example sentences that you can use to talk about daily activities, the things you normally do during the day. Are you ready? Then let's begin. Number one. Alarm clock. An alarm clock is a clock that can wake you up in the morning. For example, I always set my alarm clock for six. Number two. Afternoon. The afternoon is the part of day between noon, or 12 o'clock, and the evening, the time of day when it gets dark. You could say, for example, I usually go home in the afternoon. Number three. Arrive. To arrive means to get to a place. If someone asks you what time you get to work, you could answer, I always arrive at work at nine o'clock. Number four. Breakfast. Breakfast means the food you eat in the morning after you get up. You might ask someone, what do you usually eat for breakfast? Number five. Busy. Busy means active in some work or pastime. A pastime is something you enjoy doing in your free time. Are you busy this afternoon? Let's go see a movie. Number six. Call. When you call someone, you phone someone. You might say to your friend, Call me if you have some free time. Number seven. Commute. When you commute, you travel regularly between home and school or work. You might do this every day from Monday to Friday. Most people, when they talk about commuting, say how much time they use to commute. So, for example, they might say, I commute for an hour every day. Number eight. Cook. To cook means to prepare food to eat using heat from a stove or maybe a microwave oven. Do you like to cook? Well, I like to cook, but I'm afraid I can't cook well. Number nine. Dinner. For many people, dinner is the main meal, the biggest meal of the day, usually in the evening. Let's go to a restaurant for dinner. Hey, I like that idea. There's a great vegetarian place not too far from here. Number 10. Do exercise. To do exercise means to do physical activity to become strong and healthy. For example, I do exercise at the gym every day. Well, almost every day, sometimes. Number 11. Do homework. When you do homework, you do schoolwork outside of school. When do you do your homework? I do my homework after dinner. Number 12. Do housework. To do housework means to cook and clean at home. Do you like to do housework? Not really, but it's something you have to do. Number 13. Drink. To drink means to take in a liquid, like water, and swallow it. For example, Amy drinks tea in the morning. Number 14. Drive. To drive means to use a car or other vehicle, like a truck, for travel. For example, let's drive to the shopping mall. 
Anyone need more dog food? Number 15. Early. Early means arriving or happening before a planned or scheduled time. For example, you're early. Our class starts at 9 o'clock and now it's only 8.30 or maybe 8.45. Number 16. Eat. I'm sure you know this word. To eat, of course, means to put food into your mouth and swallow it. For example, I eat lots of fruits and vegetables. Number 17. Evening. Evening is the early part of the night at around sunset. Will you be at home this evening? Number 18. Fall asleep. To fall asleep means to go to sleep, to close your eyes and begin to sleep. That TV show makes me fall asleep. It's very boring. Number 19. Feed my cat. To feed my cat means to give food to my cat. I must go home now and feed my cat. You can use the word feed when you give food to any animal with dogs, cats, fish. You can even use the word with people. For example, I feed my kids lunch at noon. Number 20. Get dressed. Get dressed means to put clothes on your body. For example, I get dressed before I have breakfast. Number 21. Get up. To get up means to get out of bed after you wake up after sleep. Maybe I wake up at 5.30, but I get up at 6 every morning. Number 22. Get washed. When you get washed, you wash your face especially in the morning. For example, I get washed before I get dressed. Number 23. Go for a walk. When you go for a walk, you walk outside for enjoyment or for exercise. For example, I often go for a walk with my family. Number 24. Go home. When you go home, you return to your house or apartment. For example, I finish work at 5 and then I go home. Number 25. Go online. When you go online, you use the internet. I go online for two hours a day. How about you? How long do you go online for? Number 26. Go out to eat. When you go out to eat, you go to a restaurant to eat. For example, hey, let's go out to eat tonight. Number 27. Go shopping. When you go shopping, you go out to stores and buy things. You might hear someone say, I love to go shopping for new clothes. Number 28. Go to bed. When you go to bed, you go to your bedroom to sleep. If you're a mother or a father, you might say, It's already 10. It's time to go to bed. Number 29. Go to school. Go to school means to leave your home to go study at school. For example, what time do you go to school? Number 30. Go to work. Go to work means to leave your home to go to your job. For example, Wendy goes to work by taxi. How do you go to work? 
Number 31. Go window shopping. Go window shopping means to look at store products, but maybe not buy them. For example, let's go window shopping on Saturday. Number 32. Hang out. To hang out means to spend your free time just relaxing. For example, we like to hang out by the lake. Where do you like to hang out? Number 33. Have a coffee. To have a coffee means to drink a cup of coffee. For example, let's get together and have a coffee. Number 34. Hobby. A hobby is any activity you enjoy doing in your free time. For example, Sam plays the guitar. It's his hobby. My hobby is taking photos. What's your hobby? Number 35. Late. Late means happening or arriving after a planned time. For example, please don't be late for class. I'm sure your teacher often says this. Number 36. Leave. When you leave, you go away from someone or something. For example, what time do you leave work? Number 37. Listen to music. When you listen to music, you hear music on a device, like a phone or a radio, for enjoyment. For example, my little brother likes to listen to music. Number 38. Lunch. Lunch is the food that you eat in the middle of the day. For example, do you ever eat lunch at a restaurant? Number 39. Morning. Morning is the early part of the day when the sun rises. For example, what do you usually do in the morning? Number 40. Night. Night is the part of the day that is dark when you sleep. Night comes after evening. What time do you go to bed at night? Number 41. On time. On time means happening or arriving according to plan, not late. For example, you should arrive to class on time. Number 42. Order out. To order out means to phone a restaurant to ask them to send food to you. For example, I have an idea. Let's order out pizza. Number 43. Play. When you play, you spend time doing an activity for fun. Richard likes to play with his kids. Number 44. Read. To read or read books means to look at books for learning or enjoyment. For example, Maria likes to read short stories. What do you like to read? Number 45. Relax. To relax means to become less active and be more calm and happy. Ah, I'm going to stay at home and just relax. Number 46. Schedule. A schedule is a list of planned activities you want to do. For example, do you have a busy schedule next week? Number 47. See a movie. When you see a movie, you watch a film in a movie theater. But 
when you see a movie at home, you don't say see a movie. You say watch a movie. Let's stay home and watch a movie tonight. Sometimes I see a movie on weekends. Number forty-eight. Sleep. To sleep means to rest with your eyes closed and your mind not active. For example, I sleep for eight hours each night. Number forty-nine. Snack. A snack is a small amount of food eaten between meals. For example, I like to have a snack on my break. Do you like to eat snacks? Number fifty. Stay home. Stay home or stay at home means to remain in your house or your apartment. Are you feeling tired? No energy? Then you might say. I'm tired. I just want to stay home tonight. Number fifty-one. Study. To study means to learn about something, especially in school. For example, we study English at school. Number fifty-two. Take a break. To take a break means to rest for a short time while working. For example, let's take a break for ten minutes. Number fifty-three. Take a bus. How often do you take a taxi? Number fifty-eight. Wake up. To wake up means to become awake after sleeping. You might want to say, "I like to wake up late on weekends." Number fifty-nine. Walk. To walk, of course, means to move by using your feet. For example, when the weather is nice, I walk to work. Do you ever walk to school or to work? Number sixty. Wash dishes. When you wash dishes, you clean plates and cups and other things using water. For example, I hate to wash dishes, but really, does anyone like to wash dishes? Number sixty-one. Watch TV. Watching TV is something we all do. It means to look at television shows. I watch lots of TV in my free time. How about you? Do you watch lots of TV? Number sixty-two. Weekday. One week has seven days, but one week has only five weekdays. A weekday is any of the.